Hey there guys and welcome to the finale of Soul Hackers. It's been a while. I got burned out on this game. I'm I'm ready to end it. I'm ready to end this game. And we're going to do it today. So, before I started recording this episode, I did a couple runs of the uh the final boss. And I'm gonna tell you right now, we've got this. First off, I'm going to go here and actually sell my Kusanagi no Ken. So which is the uh sword that you get from fusing Orochi with a nameless sword. And instead I'm going to do is I'm going to buy an elemental sword because the game kind of lied and by it lied I mean that it gave misinformation Apsu was the uh, the physical one and Tiamat was the magical one but uh, Yuichi's message had actually said that uh, Apsu was vulnerable to physical, but that was not the case. In any case, what will you one of the two things I need done has been completed. This way. The second thing is Welcome. we oh. are going to do a fusion. Now let's see. We're going to need you, you, and you will the result be of to use? make norm. Shall I fuse these demons? This girl is going to be my saving grace. Norn of the Megami. How? Now, I don't plan on doing the post game, so I don't really care about Mag at this point. But I'm gonna buy back Osiris, because I'm gonna How need him. demons like are uh, rare gifts which you can easily get so not too hard to find okay that done I should probably equip the uh, weapon but I want to make sure I'm stocked up because I'm not doing this again or I don't plan to do it again. Uh, just poison. Okay. Revival bead. Bombs of life. Okay. Seems I'm gone, everything. I'm going to, uh, go ahead and equip the, uh, Yojin Muramasa. It's a downgrade in power and in accuracy. The uh, Levitain is a uh, magic change weapon that you get from Cert. Magic ch Mystic Change. Holy crap, I'm never going to get that correct. Anyways, now that that's done, let's head to Nikami Mon. Okay, so all I'm going to do is, I think I'm going to uh, cut and meet you back where I left off, so if you would just give me a quick moment. Okay, and we're back. Okay, so since I just did a, uh, a dry run at the boss, I'm going to Go ahead and fill in the map real quick. It shouldn't take nowhere near as long as I hope it does. Okay. Let's see here. This is a door that you 
cannot get through right now. You can get through it after you go through this door, though. <clears throat> Slow in life means swiftness and death. Uh, long story short, no, not long story short. Uh, TLDR, run or you die. That's what they mean by uh, that message. Now that we're done, let's see here. This is just a uh, shortcut because now you can go through here and go both ways with that, with that uh, door. This one you can't go through, not through this way. You can go through it a different way, but by that point you're already done. Treasure room! Yay! I don't need that. What about this? Ooh, I don't need that. Let's see. What about this? Alpha Star Road. Let's see. Is that any good? Uh, no electricity. That's not gonna help me in the upcoming fight. So, I'm not going to bother with it. Up here, though... Uh, I don't want to check that. Because if I do, there are... There is a good possibility that I may die. Why did I buy this guy back? Yeah, well. Let's bring forth the uh, the guys that I don't plan to use other than this. These guys should be good enough. The reason I bought them, well, brought them is because. This is two cherubs. They can kill you. Quite easily, as a matter of fact. They, uh... I think they repel magic? Or are null to it? It's kind of annoying. There we are. Nicely done. And you get the Masakado boots. Now, I'm not going to be using the Masakado armor. It requires I have 10 magic, and my magic stat is 4. Yeah, it's not really worth my time to use. So, I'm not going to worry about it. Post-game? Possible. That's assuming I do the post-game. I make no promises on that. Let's see here. There's nothing there. This. This right here just leads you on the way to that door, that one-way door. Is there any treasure in here, though? I don't believe so. Yeah, but that's the uh, one-way door. Do not go through it. Let's see. If you continue this way, you make progress. If you go even further down, reach a healing space. Do not pass up this healing space. Okay. 
now that we're all healed up, we can go through this. I will proceed to fill in because OCD. And it's a full moon! Yay! Actually, not yay. Let's check out this thing. What's with this place? How are we supposed to get out of here? Huh? Hey! There's something written on the wall! Offer the sign to the box, and the path shall open. I get the box part. It's talking about the chests to the left and right of here. But what is the sign that it's talking about? What do you think? I know exactly what it's talking about, but that actually reminded me. I need to go into config, and I'm going to turn auto advance on. Since this is going to be the finale, I don't really plan on pressing the button unless I have to. Okay, we gave it the sign. Oh, look, the walls! Wow, the whole wall came down. Nice! Now we can keep going. Yep. Through here is Power Stone Hall. You can't go through this one. This is a terminal. The uh, last terminal. I'm going to save my game before I proceed through here. Well, actually, uh, I'll just go in here and show off the room. This right here. This is the sanctuary where you fight the final boss. I will be right back. I'm going to go save my game, and I'm going to go fill in the map, and we will be right back. Okay, we are back. I'm about to step into the Power Stone Hall. Uh, let me show you my team. I have Osiris, Aramisaki, Norn, and Guade. At least I think that's how his name is pronounced. This is going to be the team that wins this fight. Let's go. Anxiety, 
sadness, hatred, so weak, one's own emotions can easily crush them. Right now, Manitou can only see Kodokura. We need to defeat him before we can stop Manitou. Let's do it! We can finally end this! I want... I want souls! Give me more! I'll be a bit quiet so you guys can hear this music while I'm starting to set things up. thing about this fight is that uh, Kadokura here can use Tetracarn like you just saw. And if I'm not careful, he will easily just wipe out my team. Uh, I'm going to not attack and bring back Cyrus. You keep buffing up our defense. You use Mega. I'll bring back Osiris for now. Okay, let's try and bring back Adamisaki again. Okay, sweet. I think we're good to go. That's not good. I live! This is going much worse than my uh, initial run of this. Okay, this works. This works out very well. Okay, sweet. I'm going to uh, guard. You will heal us. You will continue a nuke. And you will bring in Norn. And you will continue a sneak attack. Oh yeah, we're endless now. Okay, okay. Let's remain calm. We got this. I want to move the way back to the uh, back row. That way he doesn't get messed up. It's Megado. Uh, no, Megado. And you use Meteoron. I think we got him. No, let's not do that. Sneak attack. Megado. Meteorama. 
and Megido. Oh, crap. Oh, snap! Nice! We did it! Okay, that's the uh, first half done. Oh boy. Here comes the real challenge, though. Now this music! Woo! This music gives me chills. But, um, I think this fight is actually easier. But I'm not gonna underestimate it. Uh, I think what I'm gonna do is... Just poison Norn. Just in case. Gotcha. We gotta set up those buffs again. They didn't carry over. Nice! Nice, we got him stunned. As you can tell, he's not taking much damage from physical. But that's fine. That's perfectly fine. I am okay with him not taking much damage from that. Karama. Gotcha. Crap. Heal us up. 
There we go! That's what I like to see! That's what I like to see! Ooh, we got him in the yellow. That means at least halfway. Gentlemen, we got him. This is it. This is absolutely it. I was a little shaky a bit ago. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. But we got this. There it is. That's the final boss, guys. We won. I can hear it. Manitou's voice. Now that Kadokura is gone, my voice is reaching it. Manitou, let's go home. Back to the world we belong in. You don't have to suffer anymore. I want to be with you. With Hitomi. With everyone in the Spookies. I want to stay with you forever. I can't. Mankind's souls today can't withstand us. No matter how much we might want it, we just can't. Mankind isn't wrong, but neither is Manitou. No one is in the wrong here. It's just, we can't coexist. That's all there is to it. I need to return to Manitou. When I do, Manitou can finally die. 
that's what Manitou wants as well. This is my purpose. I am the song of death that Manitou must sing. Maybe today is my real birthday. I won't forget about you. So I'm sure we'll... Hitomi, wake up. I'm not even gonna lie, you guys, that real form of Nemesa looks pretty damn cool. credits. <sighs> it's been a long time coming, but I finally finished this LP. Now, my thoughts on it. I still like this game. I just don't think I like it to do more videos on it. It's a good game, and I definitely recommend it. But the thing is... This game doesn't have much replay value, and I think that hurts it overall. Now... I think I'm just gonna say it now, because I don't plan to do New Game Plus. But, um... In New Game Plus, there is actually a alternate ending where Spooky actually lives. I looked it up, I haven't gotten it myself, but I know that uh, at very least based on the Megami Tensei Wikia that if you go through New Game Plus and you, you answer a uh, with Madame Ginko's question with the answer I don't know and you side with Spooky when everyone else would have abandoned him and then once you get to the fight with him as Satanel apparently he will live I don't think I'm going to I don't think I'm going to play through the entire game just for a better ending I'm sorry, I, I can't. Well, I can, but I don't want to. I mean, you guys see how long just playing through the game normally took me. And, I'm sorry, I don't really think I'm going to do the, uh, the post game. I don't think so. I thought about it for a while, but I really don't think it's worth the effort. Or, I don't think it's worth putting you guys on a waiting list, waiting for a possible next video. It's, it's just not worth it. Hey, how about here? You're a member of the great hacker group, the Spookies. You ought to be able to pull this off at least. <laughs> I'm just kidding. You remember, don't you? That day, you and me hacking here, and then we met Keenap. That's when it all started. All of it. <laughs> and then Tomiko called you. So excited about Paradigm X, remember? Yeah, those were the days. Oh, hello, brother. It's me, Tomiko. A guy named Six just called. He said you should hurry up. Something about a moving truck coming soon, so you need to get going. 
That's all I have to tell you. Bye. What perfect timing. A message from Six, huh? If everybody else is getting ready, we need to get over there too. Ooh! He told me! It's been a while. Man, you guys are late. What were you doing? Making memories. If anything, you guys are too early. Well, I've got the movers coming to my place too, so... There used to be a lot of talk about how this model city would be perfect, but it ended in a flash. Everyone's leaving, huh? I liked being a spooky. Don't jump to conclusions. We're still us, right? Nothing's gonna change. He's right. We're moving to new homes, but our HQ is still right here. It always will be. I won't forget. About you all. About Leader. And I'm sure we'll meet again. Sometime. Somewhere. I'm looking forward to seeing how much you guys change in the meantime. You're right. This isn't goodbye. It's until we meet again. Aptly put. Very aptly put. They're all gone. We should get going too. <sighs> when Namissa left me, she said, I'm sure we'll meet again. So I didn't say goodbye. You're taking that with you, right? We carry everything that happened inside of us. It'll be with us forever. Let's go. We're taking our first steps. We still have a path to walk. Yeah. Let's go. What are you going to do now, Lunch? I've decided to go with Dad. I've been thinking about this for a long time. I'm thinking of being a reporter. A reporter? You? There's still a lot in this world that I don't know about. I want to see it all. What about you? Nothing special. My parents are moving back in with my grandparents. They might set up shop again there. I can't just leave them. Me? I'll take it easy for a while. I'm becoming a hacker. A super hacker like Spooky. Yeah? Well, you know what? I really think you can. Really? Are you serious, Six? I'm going to go to America with my father. I want to see where Namissa was born. So, what are you going to do? Who's to say? Even I don't know. Philosophy in my video games is always what I like. Oh, I thank you, game. I appreciate the words. We've had many game overs. But we finally reached the end. Uh, I, I really do appreciate those of you that stuck with me throughout this ridiculous journey. And it's just been really ridiculous. I like it. I like this game. It's it's one of my first Mega Ten games, and it means something to me. It took me a while to complete it my first time, but I didn't think this game was. I didn't think it was bad. It's it's definitely one of those one of the older and more dated games based on the uh, gameplay and the art style but dated does not always mean bad and while this game didn't age well 
it's still enjoyable. I definitely recommend picking up this game. It's on the Nintendo eShop. I think it's about $20. It goes on sale very often, so... Hey, if you're looking for a Atlas game, maybe try giving this one a shot. Um, I don't really know how to end off this thing. Um, let's see. Well, maybe I'll come up with a another LP that I'll have going at a more consistent rate. Until then, guys, thank you for sticking with me, and I will see you guys next time. Take care.